Hi Scorpio, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily dart readings, you can subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you this moment. Now let's start with your reading. First, let's shuffle the deck four times. Three more shuffles. This is the overall energy, but we will start with first what happened in the past and why it all happened then, at the end of this reading, there are possible actions towards you, if any. The long distance between both of you may have been one reason, but the connection fee felt very stuck. Even though there may have been put effort there to make it happen, to move forward, it seems like no matter what effort was done, it was not successful. Also, there was confusion there. Lots of confusion. Someone may have wanted to date other people as well. What is affecting you in your subconscious is that you want to avoid the ending of that connection. You want to save it. And you are being very indecisive now. You haven't decided yet to give up on them or not. Maybe you, uh, you have had other options or you have a, another option now, if it resonates, and you may be not quite decisive yet about dropping that past connection and following with this new person. At the current energies, I think you are feeling alone without them ghosted. Seems like they abandoned you. And you are at crossroads wanting to make that decision. I think you'd say yes if they ask for another chance. Yes, that's what you want, that's what you hope. Your focus is to have a communication with them. Your focus is to have the restart of that connection because you still feel connected. You still have the attraction for them. For them. And uh, what you hope is to plant the seed of commitment with this person. What is happening with them? King of Wands in the reverse. Let's see why the King of Wands in the reverse. The Fool. Four of Wands in the reverse. And the Nine. And the Seven of Wands at the bottom is Five of Wands. Would they like a restart? Yes. They would like to take a leap of faith have a restart. But I don't see them being very honest or quite stable in that relationship. So, if they were to come back, the connection would start very passionately again. But it may be on and off. So yes, they want uh, a restart, they would like it, if it was an option. At the same time, they think that that connection does not provide the stability or the commitment long term. And they see you being guarded, not being very welcoming towards them. Now let's see their possible actions. Three of Wands in the reverse. If you feel they turn their back to you, they will keep doing the same thing. Because they are not quite sure if uh, they should approach. Because they view you as being guarded. And not wanting to open up. Yes, I don't think they will take any actions. They know that you may be hurt from what happened. That's why they don't want to talk. It may have been a third party for some of you. 
the overall energy, the devil. I think mostly this connection was a toxic, unhealthy connection. And I think mostly it was at least from one partner. I think it is from them. It was mostly physical attraction than real love. I will continue in extended in fact for more details about their feelings, how do they view you, what are their intentions, and the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.